This video is for you if you are into football betting. In this video, I'm going to highlight an alternative way you can stake and make money just like you stake your bet in order to win without having to lose your hard-earned money. In betting, you lose your money if the, the, the bet did not work out. But in this very business, on this alternative, you don't lose your hard-earned money. You don't lose your hard-earned money. That is the difference. So, betting is gambling, but this is a business. So, this is called flipping. And for you to understand flipping, let me give you a, a typical example. Let's say someone, a friend of yours, wants to travel abroad. And there is a plot of land that he plans to sell in order to generate money to travel abroad. He tells you that he wants to sell that land. As a wise investor, you know there are two things you can do. You can either go and find a buyer to buy that land and you get commission. Let's say if that plot of land is 1 million naira and they give you 5% commission after that land has been sold, that means you will be earning 50,000 naira. And there is also an option for you to go and borrow money to buy that land. If you borrow that money, buy that land and resell it, it is called flipping. That's what it is called. It is called flipping. And you know, in these two options, which one do you think will generate more money for you? The second option. The second option in the sense that if you borrow money and buy that land, let's say you borrow, you have 100,000 and you borrow 900,000 to buy that land. So what you have borrowed is 900,000 and what you have at hand is 100,000. Maybe the person that have borrowed you that money, have lent you that money, that 900,000, say that you are going to repay 10% after one month. That is 90,000. So what you have spent is 1,090,000 1, naira because you are going to repay 990,000 naira. Let me use my calculator to run this so that you understand it clearly. What, what you have, I'm, I'm, I want you to understand what Philippine is all about. You have 100,000 and you have borrowed 900,000. That is 1 million naira. And the person says that you are going to repay 10%. That is 10% of 10 of uh, 900,000. 10% times by 900. 900,000. That is 90,000. So when you are going to repay the person, you are going to repay the person 990,000 plus your 100,000. 990,000 plus 100,000 that you have that is 1 million 90,000 that, that is what you are going to spend in buying that land and you know land is one thing that appreciate so far that land is in good location there is no how you won't sell that land for something like 1.3 1.5 million naira let's say now that you now sell that land sell that land within that first within that month that land is in a strategic position and you sell it for 1.5 million naira. So you're not, you're not going to do 1.5 million naira minus 1 million 90,000. 1 million 90,000. So this is 410,000 naira. And you know, in the first one, you got a buyer and they paid you 50,000 naira. But in this one, you, you borrowed money. You borrowed money to buy that land. And the total profit generated from that is 410,000 naira. That is the good thing about what? Flipping. It's a good way of flipping. We call it flipping in transaction. It's called real estate transaction. That is, land is a, a real estate property. So, that is flipping. But this one is traditional. That is physical business. But I'm talking of flipping that happens digitally. That is flipping. So, and see, I'm going to do this thing practical so that you see what, what how it works. This is flipping trade, and I'm doing this flipping trade on per investor estcon trading platform. So, it is estcon flipping trade? It's called estcon flipping trade. That is estate contract flipping trade. So, the first thing in flipping is to select the estcon. That you want to flip so the escon this is elon escon 
and I want to flip 500 500 square meters size of Elon Escon. Now, see, this leverage is just the, the money. This leverage is the money that you are being lent to do it. That is the money that you borrow. So you see, this is $500,000 required for that flipping. And the flip fee is the total money. This flip leverage plus this flip fee is the total money you are going to repay when, when after that transaction is done. Just like as mentioned, 90000 is the interest. This is just like the flip fee, just like that interest that you are going to repay. Then the flip cost is what you are going to spend. That is you, the money you are going to bring. It will cost you $24.99 to do this flipping. So that is your own money. So and now you have borrowed this five hundred thousand dollars, and the f the fee you are going to repay the additional fee is three point seven four eight five dollars. You understand? So you now enter the duration. Most times, if I'm flipping, I just enter one hour because you know flipping trade is what gives you like return of one dollar, two dollar, three dollar every one hour. Okay, let's say that you even earn one dollar every one hour. One dollar every one hour. What it means that Currently, in Nigerian rate is 1,000 Naira. Now, multiply 1,000. If you are doing this thing for 6 hours every day by 6,000, that is 6,000 Naira. And you do it, let's say, 5 days in a, in a week. 6,000 multiplied by 5. 6,000 Naira multiplied by 5. By 5 is 30,000 Naira in a week. Then multiply by, multiply by 4. That is 4, four times 4 weeks. That is in a month. You are getting 120,000 naira. This is actually small to some people and big to some people. So, but in a month, if you earn 120,000 naira as a side hustle, because you might not take this as a main, your main business, it's not bad. It's not bad to earn 120,000 naira as a side hustle, flipping. So, but you know, in betting, which I consider as a gambling, you might <laughs> be trying to use. 8,000 naira, 1,000 naira to earn 120,000 naira at a time. Sometimes you'll be spending and spending and spending and spending and spending and still the game does not enter. It's still caught and caught. So it's called pure gambling. But in this one, you know that you are sure you are going to get this required amount of money. That's why it's called business. So let me go back to the flipping. I want to stick the flipping. So I will stick the flipping now. And you know, in the next one hour, I will execute the flipping trade. So I just have to take this flipping. You say flip trades take execution dates. That is today's date, 19th December. That is execution date. So see, uh, ca can you see what is happening here now? The flip cost is $24.99. And the flip loss ranges from 30 to 31, 32. So when I will execute the trade, you will know how much I will generate. You will know how much I will generate from it. One thing I didn't do is that I didn't even check my balance, but let me just leave it this way. After we calculate the actual profit here, I wanted to check my balance and after compare the whole thing and what I have got as a profit. But let me calculate. I'm, I'm going to calculate this here. That is the flip loss minus the flip cost. Flip loss means returns on stake. Return on staking. That is flip returns on staking for staking the trade. So, but from, from what you can see here, the possible return, the highest possible return I can see is from $33. So, if you check $33 minus $24, $33 minus $24, $33 minus $24, that is $9. So, you can minus that $3, that $3 which I'm going to, I'm going to repay. I think it's 3.7, is it 3 point something dollar? But let me take it at 3.7. That is 9 minus 3.7 minus 3.7. That is 5.3 dollars. So after the whole transaction, what will be left is 5.3. That is my my that is the actual profit I generate from that particular flipping. And you know, 5.3 is all approximately 5,000 naira. 5,000 naira just within one hour. So for that flipping. So you know, in flipping, you are locking your money, so a part of your money to a borrowed money in order to realize profit so in the next one hour i'm going to execute it and we are going to calculate the exact profit that i generate he said it says that the execution time is 10 20 a.m currently is 9 22 a.m so by 10 20 i'm going to execute this very trade 
now is 10 20 and i want to execute the trade I, I will be looking at the flip ross that's what i'll be looking at once i get a maximum flip ross i will click on execute trade to execute it from what i'm seeing i'm seeing 33 points so once i get to a higher flip ross i will just click on execute remember that once it is 11 20 the staking that is the flipping trade expires and you cannot take it you cannot execute it again so this is 33.26 i will keep watching out for the highest flipping rocks on which i will click on execute in order to get a maximum net profit from what i calculated last time is 5.3 so and that should be 33 point for me to get that five point 33.5 i just click on 33.5 now you see it's 33.5 and 24.99 33.5 and 24.99 let me do the mathematics with my calculator 33.5 minus 24.9 is 8.6 let me is 8.6 approximately 9 so and the charges then was 3.7 so i will do 8.6 minus 3.7 is 4.9 approximately 5 so the one i calculated last time was let me check again is 33.5116 let me do the the total 33.5116 33.5116 minus 24.99 that is 8.5 is 8.5 not 8.6 so 8.5 dollars so let me now round it up to 8.5 so 8.5 minus 3.7 that is 4.8 that is 4,800 4, naira so it depends on your calculations once you run it down so we are getting a net profit of 4.8 that is 4.8 dollars which is 4,800 naira within one hour so it depends on the contract contract size you have traded the higher the contract size the higher the net profit you are going to generate from the flipping so you see this is not it's not actually quick uh, big money but it comes is certain it's going to come you're going to earn the profit from what i calculated i used one dollar i was using one dollar to calculate i was using that one dollar to calculate so that flipping this one is gone you can view your flip history here your flipping trade history you can view, view it here so this is that trade i executed so uh, the flip loss is 33.511 dollars then the flip is 20 the flip cost what it cost me was 24.99 so after running the calculation i was getting a net profit of 4.8 dollars within one hour so the higher the estate contract size that you use to flip the higher the profit you are going to make also it also depends on the estcon you have flipped the estcon that you have flipped it's also dependent on it so this is an alternative way you can use instead of just betting and gambling this is an alternative way which you know that is a business is a sure return you have sure returns on what you are doing so that's the alternative recommendation i have for you for people you who is betting and you know losing your hand and money you can consider this as an option to make money smartly so thanks for watching my video subscribe to my channel i'll be doing some other practical sections on estcon trading estcon trading hq is my youtube channel subscribe and click on the notification button such that anytime i drop a video you are going to get a notification about my video thank you so much for watching my video